My name is Veronica and I was going through a process where I discovered shortly after we purchased our very first home, my husband and myself and my kids, there was um, an infestation of bed bugs. And Bug. Yes, bed bugs. Ucky bed bugs. They're gonna die. They're gonna go away. And we had attempted to turn around and purchase through a company that was using electric heaters. We had turned around and we had attempted to um, spray phantom diatomaceous earth. We went through a process of even having to go the extent of purchasing a steamer and putting in like 24 man hours just trying to tear everything out and get things gone and rid of and we still had no success and then it came to the point where we decided ultimately it would probably be best to rip out all of our carpet get all of the furniture and everything we just threw everything out of our house and began the process of re replacing things with temporary items that would be sufficient for the home until we were able to attempt with our following year of tax returns to purchase doing the tenting treatment and then we found out that there's actually an easier method and it's actually doing propane heaters instead of using the electrical box heaters inside of the home the house gets much hotter and so in turn nothing even if it's inside of the walls is going to survive um, we ended up having to go and do some research because the contact that I had used previously from the other pest control company, he didn't know of anybody locally around here that used the propane heaters and so it took me going online and actually researching and I found the bug free company actually did use the propane heaters and that's when I contacted William. Mainly what we're going to do here today is slowly bring the temperature of this structure up to 140 to 150 degrees. The coolest spots, which are mainly behind the wall in the middle of the mattress, are going to get to around 120 degrees. Bed bugs die anywhere between 115 to 117 degrees. The eggs actually are destroyed at around 120 degrees. For about 30 minutes, they will completely turn to dust. We will do this job in approximately five to six hours. Uh, once we leave, we will come back with a dog, usually uh, anywhere from seven to ten days later, to run throughout the house to make sure that all the bed bugs have been destroyed. What we use is we use a dog. Her name's Allie. She does bed bug inspections. Uh, we go through condos, hotels, you know, anywhere that people may think that they have bed bugs, and she does detection work. Hey, ready to work? Come here. Come here. Show me. Good girl. Park it. Sick. 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 Show me. Show me. Good girl. This is our propane feeder. This is what feeds our propane heater. This is our gas line. I'm gonna hook this to our our heater. I've already got the heater on. I don't have, I don't have gas to yet, so it's nice. It's just, it's just blow it. Let me turn the valve on here, and we'll fire. This is our ambient sensor. This is what lets that machine, I can set the machine to whatever temperature I want. 
but I like to set it at 150 degrees. Once it gets to that 150 degrees, this machine will shut off and shut on to maintain that temperature so I can keep a constant heat in the house without getting too hot or too cold at any time. So this sensor, got a, got a metal sensor on the end, and that actually I'll hang in the center of the room. Once this room gets to 140, 155 degrees, this, this machine will just run itself. We're actually going to take the sensors, and the coolest area is going to be inside this closet. So you can see I've attached, I've attached the sensor inside this closet. And this is what tells me the reading out on my machine. What we've done is we've isolated the, all the bedroom areas that are all on the right hand side of the house. So we put the blanket and we, we uh, stapled it to the wall create a sealed uh, section of the house. Now we can heat this entire section of the house without air escaping elsewhere. We can get the most effective heat on this side that we need to. So right now it's, it's already uh, 130 in the back room. So. All right, so we're going inside the house. Right now we're concentrating on the, uh, the back bedrooms. All right, we're at about 129, 130. We should reach desired temperature in about another hour, and then we'll be able to hold it for a couple hours. Each channel will tell us what temperature these probes are eating. We're at a point now where our temperatures are where we need to be, so now it's just um, let the heat do its thing. Um, I'll go in about every 15 minutes, and I'll just check, make sure everything's still staying heat. I'll flip the mattresses, I'll flip couches, I'll flip things over about every half hour just to keep the heat moving around. We don't want no cool areas. And uh, I'm gonna start recording on my, my Tegum. Every 10 minutes I'd make a recording. Make sure our temperatures are rising. And um, really about it. Now it's just uh, let the heat do its thing. We've done ours and now let the heat do its. And we are just thankful that this problem is gonna stop. So we thank Bug Free and we thank Allie for even coming out here and, and checking the area out and we cannot wait to have this problem dead, done and over with. We're two weeks later of bug free being in our home and doing the heat treatment. I am just incredibly impressed. I haven't seen any bugs. There's been no bites on any of my children or my husband. We just are incredibly thankful because these guys came in here. They did their job. It was twice an improvement compared to the other company we had initially used. And we just are going to continue to keep an eye out at this point, but we're we're more than 100% pleased at this at this point in time where there's been no results left over from the mess we had from before and so we're officially at this point believing we are 100% complete bug free from these bed bugs and we just thank the guys that came out and took the time to do their job and to help us get rid of this mess that we've been battling for over a year and we just thank the company for doing you know an awesome job thank you bug free